I'm thrilled to have you join us today for a journey into boosting your intelligence. Imagine unlocking the secrets of a sharper mind and a clearer outlook on life. Sounds intriguing, right? Well, that's exactly what we're diving into today in our video titled Boost Your Intelligence with Seven Stoic Techniques. Now, you might be wondering, why Stoicism? What's the buzz about these ancient techniques? Stick around and you'll discover how these principles are more than just old school philosophy. They're like a mental gym for your brain. We're not here for complicated jargon or mind boggling theories. We're here to explore practical ways to elevate your intelligence. So what's in it for you? Picture this gaining a better understanding of yourself making wiser decisions and navigating life with a newfound clarity. It's not about becoming a genius overnight. It's about simple, actionable steps that can make a real difference in your everyday intelligence. Now, you wouldn't want to miss out on that, would you? Join us as we uncover the seven stoic techniques that can enhance your cognitive abilities and set you on a path to a more intelligent and fulfilled life. Trust me, the benefits are worth the watch. So, buckle up, hit that play button, and let's boost your intelligence together. Exciting, right? Let's get started. Let's break down the core principles of Stoicism in a way that's easy to grasp. Stoicism, at its core, is a practical philosophy that's not just about deep thoughts or complex theories. It's a way of life a guide to navigate the ups and downs with a steady mind. Think of it as your mental compass, helping you find direction in the chaos of life. Now, what makes Stoicism unique are its fundamental principles. Wisdom, courage, justice and temperance. Wisdom, not just about book smarts, but the practical understanding of life. Courage, the strength to face challenges with resilience. Justice, not just in the legal sense, but in treating others and ourselves fairly. And temperance, the balance in our actions and desires. But why connect Stoicism with intelligence? Well, it's like adding rocket fuel to your brain power. When you embrace Stoic principles, you're not just getting a set of rules. You're upgrading your mindset, and that has a direct impact on your cognitive abilities. Imagine your mind is a finely tuned instrument. Stoicism fine, tunes it even further. The relationship between a stoic mindset and intelligence is like a dynamic duo. When you approach life with wisdom, your decision making becomes sharper. Courage empowers you to face challenges head on, boosting problem, solving skills. Justice in your actions enhances your understanding of the world. Temperance brings a balance that keeps your mind focused and clear. In simple terms, Stoicism becomes the secret sauce for a more intelligent you. It's not about being the smartest person in the room. It's about navigating life with a heightened awareness and a mind that's ready for anything. So, if you're up for a mental upgrade, embracing Stoic principles might just be the key. It's like giving your brain a gym session, and the results are a more resilient, wise, and intelligent you. All right. Let's delve into the first Stoic technique, mindfulness meditation. Picture this as a mental spa for your brain. Mindfulness in simple terms is being fully present in the moment. It's not about emptying your mind, but rather about focusing on what's happening right now. So how does this help? Well, it's like giving your mind a breather. Mindfulness fosters mental clarity by untangling the knots of chaotic thoughts. Imagine your mind is a busy highway. Mindfulness is the traffic cop that brings order and calmness. It's not about shutting out the world. It's about being aware of it without getting overwhelmed. Now mental clarity is fantastic. But what about focus? Mindfulness is like a spotlight for your attention. In a world full of distractions, it helps you zoom in on what truly matters. It's training your mind to stay in the moment, 
whether you're working on a project or simply enjoying a cup of tea. With mindfulness, your focus becomes a superpower, allowing you to tackle tasks with a precision that was once elusive. So, in a nutshell, mindfulness meditation in Stoicism isn't about escaping reality. It's about embracing it with a clear and focused mind. It's your passport to mental serenity and a tool to sharpen your cognitive abilities, ready to give it a try. Stay tuned as we unravel more stoic techniques that can bring a positive transformation to your life. Let's now explore another powerful stoic technique, negative visualization. Now, don't let the word negative fool you. It's not about dwelling on the gloomy side of life. Instead, it's a mental exercise where you imagine the absence of the positive things you have. It might sound counterintuitive, but bear with me. Imagine taking a moment to reflect on the people, possessions, or experiences that bring joy to your life. Now think about how it would feel if those were suddenly gone. It's not about inducing fear or anxiety, but rather about cultivating gratitude for the things we often take for granted. So, how does this impact gratitude? Negative visualization acts as a gratitude booster. By briefly considering the absence of what we cherish, we develop a deeper appreciation for them. It's like adding a layer of value to the everyday aspects of our lives. Instead of waiting for a wake-up call, this technique nudges us to acknowledge and be thankful for the positive elements in our present. Now, let's talk resilience. Life throws curveballs, right? Negative visualization is like a mental shield. By envisioning potential setbacks or losses, we prepare ourselves emotionally. It's not about expecting the worst, but rather building a robust mindset that can bounce back from adversity. This technique, in a way, inoculates us against the shock of unexpected challenges. Think of it as a mental vaccination. You expose yourself to a mild version of the hardship in your mind, making you better equipped to handle it if it were to occur. It's a proactive approach to fortify your emotional well-belly. So, negative visualization in Stoicism is not a plunge into pessimism. It's a strategic exercise to amplify gratitude and build resilience. It's a tool that helps us appreciate what we have and stand resilient in the face of life's uncertainty. Let's delve into the Stoic technique of value clarification. In Stoicism, values are not just abstract concepts. They are the guiding principles that shape our actions and decisions. Think of values as your moral compass, pointing you towards what truly matters in life. It's not about a set of rules imposed from the outside. Rather, it's an internal compass that directs your choices based on what aligns with your core beliefs. Now, how does this connect with decision-making? Imagine your values as the foundation of a sturdy building. When you align your decisions with your values, it's like constructing a solid structure. Decisions become clearer, and actions are more purposeful. It's about living in harmony with your principles, rather than being swayed by external pressures or fleeting emotions. Aligning with personal values enhances decision-making, by providing a consistent framework. Instead of grappling with conflicting ideas, you have a reliable guide that helps you navigate through choices. It's not about making decisions easier. It's about making them more meaningful and authentic. Let's break it down further. If, for example, honesty is a core value, it becomes the litmus test for your decisions. When faced with a choice, you ask yourself, does this align with my value of honesty? If the answer is yes, you move forward confidently. If it's no, it's a signal to reconsider. Value clarification in Stoicism is about bringing intentionality to your choices. It's not about adhering to a rigid set of rules, but about understanding what truly matters to you. This clarity transforms decision-making from a daunting task into a purposeful journey. It's a tool that empowers you to live a life that resonates with your deepest beliefs. 
Let's dive into the enriching world of Stoic reading. It's not just about flipping through pages. It's a journey into the timeless wisdom of Stoic literature. So why should you explore it? Well, think of Stoic literature as a treasure trove of insights, a collection of thoughts that have withstood the test of time. Encouraging you to delve into Stoic literature is like handing you a key to unlock a room filled with valuable lessons. These writings, often penned by ancient philosophers like Seneca, Marcus Aurelius, and Epictetus, are not just words on paper. They are nuggets of practical wisdom that can shape your mindset and guide you through life's ups and downs. Now, how does reading these ancient texts positively influence your mindset? It's like having a conversation with a wise friend who's been through it all. The words resonate with timeless truths about resilience in the face of challenges, finding tranquility amidst chaos, and cultivating virtues that stand the test of time. Stoic literature becomes a companion on your journey, offering perspectives that are both profound and applicable to your daily life. It's not about complex theories or unreachable ideals. It's about practical advice that can bring about positive changes in your mindset. Imagine facing a tough situation, and you recall a passage from Marcus Aurelius that echoes the importance of staying calm and focused. That's the power of Stoic reading. It becomes a source of strength and guidance when you need it the most. In a world filled with constant noise, Stoic literature is a quiet anchor. It's an invitation to pause, reflect, and absorb timeless wisdom. So, I encourage you to explore Stoic literature, not as a task, but as a gift to your mind, a gift that keeps on giving, shaping your mindset, and enriching your perspective on life. Let's shine a spotlight on the invaluable practice of routine reflection. It's not about a grand time, consuming ritual, but a simple yet powerful act of pausing and looking back on your day. Why is this daily reflection so crucial? Well, think of it as a mental snapshot, a moment where you hit the pause button on the hustle and bustle of life. Daily reflection is like taking a step back to catch your breath and assess the path you've traveled. It's not about dwelling on the negatives, but rather about acknowledging the victories, big or small, and recognizing areas where growth is possible. This intentional pause in your routine becomes a tool for self-improvement. Now, how does routine reflection contribute to self-improvement? It's akin to having a personal progress report. By reflecting on your actions, decisions, and reactions, you gain insights into your patterns and behaviors. It's not about judgment, but about understanding. You become the observer of your own life, noticing what worked well and what could be refined. Imagine it as a continuous loop of learning. You identify areas where you excelled and celebrate those wins, boosting your confidence and motivation. On the flip side, if there were hiccups or challenges, routine reflection provides a chance to strategize. What could be done differently next time? It's a continuous cycle of learning and growing, and the beauty lies in its simplicity. Routine reflection, in essence, is a commitment to your own personal development. It's not reserved for a select few. It's a practice that anyone can adopt. Whether you jot down your thoughts in a journal, take a few moments of quiet contemplation, or simply mentally review your day, the key is to make it a habit. In the grand tapestry of self-improvement, routine reflection becomes a thread that weaves together your experiences, lessons, and aspirations. So, as we navigate through life, let's not forget the power of this simple yet transformative practice. Let's explore the uplifting aspect of Stoicism known as community connection. Now, in the Stoic philosophy, it's not all about solitary introspection. It recognizes the profound role of social bonds in our lives. So, why is this connection with others essential in Stoicism? Think of it as building a support network, a community that shares common values and principles. In Stoicism, fostering social bonds isn't just an add-on. It's a vital part of leading a meaningful life. 
These connections become pillars of strength, providing support during life's challenges and celebrations during moments of joy. But how do these interpersonal connections enhance emotional intelligence? It's like having emotional workout partners. Engaging with others helps you understand a spectrum of emotions, from joy to sorrow, empathy to frustration. It's not just about your own experiences. It's about learning from the diverse emotional landscapes of those around you. Imagine a friend sharing their struggles, and through empathy, you navigate the labyrinth of emotions with them. This process sharpens your emotional intelligence. It's about recognizing and understanding emotions, both in yourself and in others. Stoicism acknowledges that we are social beings, and our interactions with others provide valuable lessons in emotional literacy. These connections act as mirrors, reflecting aspects of ourselves that we might not see on our own. It's a reciprocal learning journey where sharing experiences enhances not only your understanding of emotions, but also your ability to respond empathetically. In Stoicism, community connection becomes a two-way street of support and growth. So, as we embrace the Stoic philosophy, let's not overlook the significance of community. It's not about surrounding ourselves with a multitude of acquaintances. It's about cultivating meaningful connection. These relationships become a fertile ground for emotional intelligence to flourish, making us not only more understanding of others, but also more attuned to our own emotional landscape. In wrapping up our exploration of Boost Your Intelligence with seven Stoic techniques, let's quickly recap the key takeaways. We've journeyed through Stoic principles, discovering the wisdom, courage, justice, and temperance that form the foundation of this philosophy. Connecting Stoicism with intelligence, we unveiled how a Stoic mindset sharpens cognitive abilities. From mindfulness meditation to community connection, each technique has been a practical tool for enhancing various facets of our intelligence. The importance of incorporating these Stoic techniques into our lives cannot be overstated. It's not about a drastic overhaul but rather a steady integration of these practices into our daily routines. Picture it as small, consistent steps towards a more thoughtful, resilient, and intelligent version of ourselves. As we embrace Stoicism, we're not just adopting a philosophy. We're embracing a way of life that empowers us to navigate the complexities of the modern world with a clear and focused mind. Now, here's the invitation Let's make it real. I encourage each one of you to implement these stoic techniques in your daily lives. Whether it's the mindfulness moments, the power of negative visualization, or the strength of community connection, let them become a part of your journey towards personal growth. Before we sign off, I want to express heartfelt gratitude for joining us on this exploration. Your time and engagement mean the world to us. We're eager to hear your thoughts and experiences, so don't hesitate to share them in the comments below. Have you tried any of these techniques, or do you have your own insights to contribute? We're all ears. As we conclude this chapter, stay tuned for more exciting content. We're committed to providing valuable insights, so if there's a specific topic you'd like us to dive into, drop your suggestions in the comments. Until then, thank you for being a part of our community, and here's to your journey of boosting intelligence through Stoic wisdom.